I would like to take this opportunity to introduce to you Dr. Lesan Azadi, Director of Baha'i Academy. We are passing through a time when there are two parallel processes simultaneously happening around us. One is a process, and I said negative forces which are around us. That destruction is for destroying the old fragmented world. One process which is happening around us is actually destroying whatever is an obstacle to achieving unity. And the other process is those things that really are working to bring the world together. Let's think for a moment. Are you all happy with the present situation of the world? I think we are really, really in between. We are generation of half light, neither too good nor too bad. So really, both these processes of destruction, construction, negative, positive, they are really moving at very high speed together. We really have to figure out where are we going to be in these uh, two parallel processes. This really needs us to reflect. What is going to be my priority in whatever profession I take in future? And is there something that I can do, I can contribute to making the world a better place? We are the ones who should bring about change. Today you are a student, tomorrow you are manager, your minister, your policy maker, you are somebody, but all of us, no matter what we become, no matter what capacity we serve, we all can bring about change. If we are not ready to change, then how can we bring about a change? What is change and what is transformation? Look at these two pictures, according to you, which one is a change, represents change, and which one represents transformation? Change is maybe a short time. It changes from one state to other. Transformation maybe takes longer time. Yes, a bud to become a flower, of course, takes much shorter time compared to a egg to become a butterfly. So the real change is transformation. Transform yourself to become who you really are. If you want to change, to transform, then first we should know who we are. You're not just, not just a creature, not just a very common man. You are really a mine of gems. When I say you means each one of you sitting in this room, there's no common man here. No, each one of you is a mine of gems. Education should help us to reveal the gem which is within us. When you were born 17, 18, 23 years ago, God gave you as a gift to your parents take it i'm giving you a mine of gems and i think that is what we have to believe yes you are here two years let the two years of your mba bring out the treasures which are within you make a list of as many gems as you honestly have thank you so much for your full-hearted participation <laughs>